Hey, it's Coolio. If you don't know this, it's time for some more of the long run where we are playing Lufia 2 Ocarina of Time. And uh, last time we ended up with uh, kind of an annoying uh, plant based herbicidal puzzle. It's basically it's either uh, them or us. Um, we're gonna we're gonna figure that out pretty much in short order here once we get going. But also, you probably notice um, a, a significant amount of time has passed. And let's get into what's up with that. So first of all, you'll you will notice that we're on Forfeit Island. Um, the first thing that I did after we left off last time was go get the VIP card. Uh, which is actually uh, the Prince of Aralio has it, and you can get it by talking to him twice. I only talked to him once before. Uh, after the Dan Kirk Aralio thing is resolved. So that gives us. Uh, no, this is the forfeit shop. We need to go. <laughs> Come on, really? Over here. So this uh, gives us access to the VIP room, which has two things. It has this thing here. I'll take a second and show it off. Also you'll see how many coins I have right now. Uh, I don't know. So this is, this is five card stuff. It is, you know, your sort of five card poker, I'm not really paying a whole lot of attention to what everyone else is trying to do here. I'm just going to try to aggressively outbid everyone and see if anyone decides to fold. I have pretty much squad all and uh, neither does the opponent. Yeah, I think this is a draw between the two of us. So I guess we're doing it again. No, no splitting the pot. Doing pretty good. Oh, there goes a straight chance. Now, keeping in mind that the other players cannot see your first card until all the cards have been dealt. So you absolutely can be um, bluffing. But I didn't really have a whole lot of anything to bluff at that point. Uh, it was either I had a pair or I didn't have anything in this case. I didn't have anything. Both of them had... Wait. Okay, I guess uh, the player on the right probably had a stronger pair. But the real attraction here is this. So it is just Adventure 7, the same slot machine as outside, except that this one takes 100 points. Thing is, if you just hold down up, it'll go by itself. So what I did, and I've done this before, I, I took my save RAM file from the computer, put it on the 3DS, um, ran the uh, slot machine on the 3DS with basically just a piece of paper wedged into um, the control knob so that it's just stuck on up. And yeah, pretty much just let that run for, like, a good 20 hours. Um, from that, I already have a Dragon Blade for Maxim because I thought the Maximum was going to be, um, a million minus one, which ended up now, not being the case, it's actually probably 10 million minus one. Um, and yes, 
Uh, guy is getting a dragon blade. Uh, Artea is getting a bunny blade. And Selim's getting a bunny blade. These other things I'm not too concerned about. I am. I find it hilarious that Artea can equip the bunny suit, personally. Uh, we're also going to get a chest sonar, and I don't think I have a magic lamp. We'll get one for the heck of it. And just because, let's, uh, let's get a fortune ring. I don't think I'm ever going to use it. Um, you'll also notice my gold is pretty low. Bunny sword damage is weird. Well, if it starts to get too weird, um, we can just equip something else. It's not a big problem. Uh, it's not cursed, so we won't have to worry about that. Oh, I forgot as well to um, update this here so that it says this and that. That and that and that and save. Also, don't mind my fridge, it has started screaming again. I don't know what causes it, and I don't know why it stops doing that. So, but um, yeah, all of the um capsule monsters are now up to rank 4, uh, which I mostly used um, the forfeit shop to do. Uh, and all of them had some pretty uh, even requirements for feeding, which weren't really all that hard to get, except this bitch who kept asking for the most expensive possible stuff including some stuff that I have not even seen in the game yet. <laughs> I'm poking fun, Joel. You're, you're fine. It's just this capsule monster who has become the Hulk with Potentially full diapers? I don't know. I don't know what that what that's supposed to look like, but it looks like something. Um, and I also took the opportunity, since I had that guide open anyway, to look up how you get to Master Rank, and it is dumb. Now the first step is pretty logical. You get your capsule monster to rank four. So you get here, it says, I'm not hungry. Which, by the way, something that I found out after I got done feeding everyone, if you go on this screen and press select, it tells you your current capsule monster and what they're looking for in terms of food. And I bet that at least one of you out there probably didn't know that. I found this out by accident. Anyway, like I said, first step, get your capsule monster to four. Then you want to feed it a specific fruit. And in the case of... Uh, Mazzy here is the secret fruit. Now you want to be careful about doing this because once you turn them to master class, you can't use any other forms unless you give them a fruit to, to change them back to their non-master transformation. But we're just gonna go master. I don't really know like... I don't know that there is a specific reason that you would want to go non-master again, but anyway. Secret fruit.
I don't. I'm not gonna be able to uh, transform everyone. I think. And also, they changed the names of some of these for so I might mess this up. But now here is the thing. You think, well, I just go in here and feed Foos here the fruit that she's looking for to uh, transform to master. You can't just do that. In order to change to master rank, they need to be a specific rank. You need to select the specific rank that they need to be, and then um, the guide here says charm fruit, and um, I can only guess that this means I'm gonna save save for good measure. I think they renamed this to magic fruit. No. Okay, I guess I don't have the correct fruit for this, but um, should be uh, rank three. Let's for fun. Let's try rank four. Now, okay. Well, I guess Foose isn't isn't ranking up. Um, Sonya here is gonna need to be rank two. And uh, we'll need to be fed. Magic? No? I think there are only seven types of fruit. Yeah, at least it's not using it up, so that's why like, I'm not worried about using all of them. Well, that's weird. Uh, so this one needs to be class 3. And it says charm fruit. Uh, Jewel, I, I have the list up here. Like, I'm, I'm looking at the same guide I assume you're looking at. Can I only have one master rank? this working. The zero is wind fruit, which was breeze fruit. I mean, I tried all of them. Yeah, flame fruit. The part of the problem as well is that um, this is using the uh, default names for um, for the capsule monsters, and we changed all of the names.
I don't know. Huh. I mean... I guess I should have tried it beforehand. I did actually, like, um, while I was doing this, test out that it works for Mazzy. I didn't test any of the other ones, but I figured that it would work as well. I had no reason not to believe that it wouldn't, but it's not. Try everything on everything, I guess. And I know it's not going to be one. Oh. But we got another one. Okay, now we got two, uh, Garf is dark, uh, hang on, what form do you need to be? Dark needs to be two, none of these are The other ones just to be sure. I didn't intend to be spending so much time on just figuring out why this doesn't work. Kevin, soil, so we have I'm just wondering if there's more than just these fruits that I've found. No, the, the list that you sent me is the same list that I am looking at. Like, it is from the same guide. The, the second one here is light, but I don't think, because you, you would need the charm for, oh well, maybe, I don't know. No, but this one is wind, and wind is fourth on that list. No, wind is last on that list, never mind. So the, the list is not in the same order. Uh, we have flame. Yeah, which one is flame? You. But oh, we tried all of we tried all of our fruit on the fire dude including definitely the flame one on all of the forms and it didn't do anything. Okay, well, we got another one. Yeah, 
Yeah, maybe they just changed everything around, because, like, we've... We're, we're getting all of these at rank 4, I think. Well, anyway, we got four of them. Uh, so let me go ahead and update the capsule list again. I don't have... I forgot to set up the Twitch connection. Yay! And now that's on cooldown for five minutes. Well, I can invoke it manually. There we go. Ha! Ah. So we got some of them. We, we don't got all of them, but we got some of them. And uh, normally I would need you to uh, do the redeem thing to pick one, but like I didn't have any better idea right now, so. Okay. So with that all out of the way, Get out of my way, please. I'm trying to remember where it is that I'm trying to freaking go. I, I am kind of... I'm a little fried after that entire exchange. Okay. Just as in the way as possible, so thank you. <coughs> There are some places in the world where you can go grind for um, for fruits, and I might do that in between sessions again, now that I've established that this is a thing that you can do. Wooden blade? That's kind of boring. Anyway, let's test out these bunny blades. And dragon blades. Oh dear. Oh dear. Okay. Now I see what you mean. That's... Hmm. Oh, that... This is a very good start. Just... Absolutely wreck my stats. Right. I'm trying to see what the deal is with the bunny blade. Uh, bunny sword, which you know, original name for the bunny blade, uh, says to have an ATP of 500, but the base damage it deals is always 120. Therefore, the sword itself does no damage against stronger enemies. 
ATP, however, is counted for IP attacks, resulting in real killer attacks when used with triple strike and head attack, for example. I see. Oh geez, Artea's uh... Hmm. Yes, Fridge. It's, it's great that this is what we're doing. And that we're going to die. I mean, that didn't do a whole lot of damage, honestly. So yeah, we're going to be switching off of the bunny blade as soon as we're out of this fight. At least we we had uh, we had an experiment, and it didn't work out. Um, I think you might have had the zircon rod. And you might have had the silver rod. I don't remember what they had. Ah. <sighs> Someday, someday I'll, I will throw this fridge out the window. You know what, if I really want a, a bunny blade again, I can just get one. I'm going to drop these. I'm just going to drop them. So that we can just... Use uh, best equipment. So after that disaster of a fight, let's uh, heal up. Oh boy, guess what we're fighting again. At least this time we're not going to use uh, very misleading equipment. Instead, we're going to deal 1226 damage in one hit. The dragon swords are the dragon swords are red. Oh jeez. Well, she somehow survived that at the very least. But yeah, like the the only thing that I can figure is that um, the fruit trilogizer patch or the fruit leafia patch, probably specifically, um, changed how it works, so that you can just use the correct fruit on. Um, on the fourth form, rather than some arbitrary form that the game evidently never tells you. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, is this the most annoying trick? Where you have to like... Okay, I'm gonna worry about that after we've done the other thing. Oh, right. Um, not bomb, but fire arrows. Or not. Bomb chain reaction. Okay, gotcha. And that was just for a sonic ring, but hey, at least we don't have to worry about, like, but what's over there, I wonder? Well, now we know. I guess I could also just use that, uh, that pole there to... Okay, so we're gonna have to do this puzzle. in us. can do with our uh, dragon blades is kill dragons. I'll use the IP during a boss duel, don't worry. I do not remember where that plant puzzle was. But it's probably behind the locked door. Self stuck. Okay, 
Well, now I can't leave those chests just lying there, can I? That would just be rude. Oops. We got a miracle. Escard ring. Magic scale. Okay, that's 30 points of uh, defense. Uh, let's give it to Artia. Why not? I was hoping for a uh, dragon egg there, but uh, oh well. To this room. So Jewel here gave me a guide on how to solve this and we're gonna be using the guide because I don't want to be here for like another half hour after having to figure out why I couldn't upgrade my capsule monsters. So we're gonna shoot that down here and shoot upward and that one's gonna come up. That is not the one that I was expecting to come up next. I was expecting bottom left to come up next. Uh, middle left to come up next, sorry. Well, that's troublesome. Can I still make this work? Probably not. Spend a turn, a turn too many. Okay, so take the fire arrow and do uh, do walk where Maxim also shows you where to go. Make sure uh, you make sure be sure to make good use of the turn around without moving option. Wait for this plan to come up. Shoot sprout. Move here. And it looks like that. Shoot the plane to the left. Move here and shoot the plant on top. But then the guide here is showing that the next one is supposed to be middle left, but it's not that. Then it's not the top one. I mean, maybe it is, but like, why would they change it? This is already kind of miserable.
Okay, there's another solution here. Right, down, 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 turn left, fire. But then it says left, fire. Oh, okay. Probably just skip a turn and fire. Down, right, turn up, fire. Left, 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 turn down, fire. Skip a turn, fire. Yeah, this is working. Right, 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 turn up and fire. Turn down and fire. Left, left, turn down, fire. Right, right, turn up and fire. Left, up, turn left and fire. Down, left, turn up and fire, turn down and fire, and that's the last one. So I don't know what solution the other one was, uh, was trying to show, but uh, it's not correct. <sighs> anyway, let's move on. That didn't look suspicious at all. I wonder if I can use... Wait, is it regenerating? It is. Fascinating. boom needed, but like I can't provide any faster boom. there too. Can I now use him? Aha! Okay. Oh boy! Let's uh, take a look at down here. Uh, down here first. There's a save point. I should probably use it. A thing for an extra Friday stream?
four. Oh, just one of these. Just need to figure out how to work it. Okay, I've done these before. don't necessarily remember how to do it offhand, but Like, the, the fascinating thing for me is, like, how did they implement this into this engine? I know I've solved this before, I just don't remember how to do it. It sure is a tune, by the way. I think what I need to do right now is bring some of these loose ones up here. can do something.
then that's not. Nah, then that's stuck. Sometimes I try the words and they come out the wrong order. And I'm basically at the beginning of the puzzle again. Sure. Maybe I need to get these. In the worst case, I I can bring up a solution for this as well because like I am not dedicating an entire stream to this puzzle. Like, I'm not doing a Friday stream. If I'm doing extra streams, it's for Ancient Cave and nothing else. same side. Is that a good thing? The answer is probably no. All right. just gonna we're just gonna look this up because I do want to move on with the game like we are getting close to the end I could figure this out eventually just like y'all don't want to watch me do this if you do well sorry side. Okay. We want to move this over here. That over there. Um, this there. Okay. Nope. This here. Okay, so I had this part right, I'm pretty sure. Um, oh no, there we go. We need, we need it to be like that. Correct. We're in the stage. Uh, 
I think I might have bungled it. Maybe. I don't know. We can get back to the previous stage. There, 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 okay. So the next stage is to move the horizontal one down. DVD screensaver bouncing around in your head. this again because like the way that, th that this guide describes it is really weird and like it's trying to do so with text This one's also trying to, to describe it with text, so I mean, back when this game came out, you pretty much had text walkthroughs, like that, that was what was available, right? Okay, now we got all the singles, and I don't like video guides. I simply do not like video guides. I want pictures, but I don't want moving pictures. Okay, so move six up and right, eight up and up. Um, three to the right. I think this might be um, this might be the same instructions, just presented a little more cleanly.
I should have. Two singles, two verticals, the big boy, single, vertical, vertical, single. Okay. Making progress here. Okay, so next. This state. Make sure that this state is correct. So three singles there, two verticals, two verticals there. Yes, okay. The state is correct. This one. Yep. So now we have all of our horizontal, all of our verticals up on the top. Should be, yeah, I don't need to follow this guy anymore. There we go. 
We got it, eventually. I had to follow a guide, but whatever. I'm not worried about it. How are you able to do it? Gotta guide out. Bijou shield. Godly robe. Godly helm. And the Dragon Slayer. Man, spent all that time getting um, the uh, Dragon Blades, and now we have the Dragon Slayer. It, and it's not even. Oh, there we go. Artea's weapon. It's Artea's weapon. I don't think we got any rocks or rates from that. So. And just for getting here, we also get an Esperon Ring. A Miracle. And an Escurio Ring, which is one of the things that I know uh, Sonya was asking for. We also get a Hydra Rock, which I think we already had. Well, I mean, that's a direct upgrade. I don't think anyone has the Curio ring. Strange and mysterious ring. S stands for Supa. Now, give the yes, Curio Ring, I'll give you the yes, Garden Ring. You're mainly our healer, really. Oh, this looks like a friendly ring. This cast mirrored nothing else. Also, to be fair, I didn't actually have to do the puzzle for the ring. I just had to get to the puzzle for the ring. And then, like, on the way out, um, you're able to get the, uh, the chest with that S curio ring in it. Cast Nero refuses to elaborate further, dies violently. Exactly. Uh, something else that I did while uh, in between sessions was a um, basically I did a uh, oh my goodness an ancient cave run that w I was intending this to be completely non-canonical so you know win or lose I wasn't gonna save it anyway Although I felt a little silly when I got to like level 60 or 70 or so, started getting overconfident, was barely paying attention to what was going on, just kept pressing buttons, didn't notice my party dying, and then I died. So, you know, 
whether or not I... Rude. Whether or not I was intending for the run to be non-canonical, it ended up being non-canonical anyway because I died, so I lost everything. Please stop killing the capsule monster, holy crap. Yep, should have seen that coming. Oh dear. Ah! Ooh. Well, that was fun. Not even sure if I'm doing this for something. I'm mm, I'm willing to bet that this warp goes back to the start and I'm going to save state before I try it because I don't want to be, to just be unceremoniously dumped it back at the beginning. Yep, that's what it did, huh? That's the exit. We're not doing that. I'm allowing myself that save state because I called it. But this is a dangerous place. A dragon's coming, so go home. That's what I should say to you. It's dangerous for an old man to hang around here. Don't think of me as an ordinary person. Maxon. So this is the dragon? Go quickly, go! Don't worry, old man. We are not ordinary people either, right, Maxon? Yeah. Alright, I probably should have yelled up, but we're doing this. So, dragon fire, attack all enemies, heavy, heavily, dra heavily damages dragon as well. Turns out we're fighting a dragon. Let's look at everything else quickly, but we're gonna be using We're gonna be using that as well. Uh, you're going to be healing everyone. Oh, what a stranger. And you're going to be using Dragon Rush. Yeah, that worked pretty well. That didn't work as well, but oh jeez. I'm sorry, Sonya. What damage buff are you talking about? Oh, I, I didn't get any spells. I probably should have, but um... I did enough. But listen, I spent 20 hours at a casino, and then started running around the entire world, mostly, you know, the forfeit shop, but also having to run around a little bit to get everyone fed, especially Sonya.
I say, hey, what do you have? Store HP of each member of your party by user's max HP level. Okay, well then Maxim doesn't need to uh, spend his turn healing. We're just gonna use Crisis Gear. Unfortunately, now Guy and Selen have decided that they are EP and going to sleepy. Still not enough. I find it fascinating that Artea is actually, like, naturally faster than Maxim. Anyway, we won. You... you folks... who are you anyway? And these energy waves? You can sense the energy waves? I told you I'm not an ordinary person. I see you are the warriors fighting the gods. Yes. I thought so. Then you should go to Priya Mara. Well, it's not possible for humans to. What's wrong? Well, alright, if you happen to come to Chade, would you come by my place? Yes, we could do that. I may be able to help you. Let's talk about it more at my place. Alright. I'll go back to Chade. Actually, I hate heat. I just can't stand this heat. I'm just here because someone paid me to be here. I really feel like there are some chests that we're leaving behind here. And at this point, unfortunately, I'm not going to be able to um, just go back. I would have to go all the way back around. I am going to check a guide here and see if we missed a dragon egg. How many dragon eggs do we have? I went right by it. Actually, I was past it already. We have six. As far as I can tell from this guy, we should have all of them already. I'm trying to figure out, like, what's the deal with these dragon eggs. Yeah, like, the, as best as I can tell, we should already have all of them. But, like, Zero's not here to... to lead me on the right path, so I don't know. It's 
because I've been kind of relying on him, and last week he, he was away because his sister was there, and well, he's not here today yet either, so either that or he is... Yeah, I know there are eight. Fridge, please. I don't need this right now. Anyway, if I'm right and we should have all of them, then that means that there are none here. Really? Oh, okay. Well, I mean, if you're gonna give me cores... Um... I was reading. Uh, great. Okay. Well, cool. If the legend is true, I want you to have it. You can really use it. I, it's no use to me anymore. Okay. I understand, and I thank you. Yeah, sometimes I lose track of the... Um, of the state of my mute... So... Like, what I need is, like, a, a big honkin' symbol in front of me. Like, you, you can see that I'm muted. Unless I am looking at the stream deck, I have no idea, and, I'll f and there's also a chance that the stream deck is just giving me false information anyway, because it keeps its own states independent of what's actually true. I mean, I was partially muted because of the fridge, but also, like, I don't necessarily know what state that I'm in unless I'm looking at the thing 
And like, I, my brain is mush. I do not remember whether or not it's in mute unless I look at the thing. Uh, sir, please stop merging with Guy. Anyway, um... But yeah, the, there are definitely some eggs that were missing. Now let me, um... I'm wondering if that website that you gave me... There, it, yeah, it has a dragon egg guide. Hopefully this uh, information is correct because it uh, certainly did not give me correct information uh, to begin with. So there's the cave to Sunnelton, Alun's basement, the daughter of the bridge builder in Merrick's after his return, North Dungeon and Bound Kingdom, North Lighthouse and Parcelite, Flower Mountain, Dankirk North Cave, and Divine Shrine. So I guess let's do that next. I've been to all of these places, but clearly I'm missing some eggs. Uh, so the easiest one to check, obviously, is just Merrick's. The daughter of the bridge builder, so... Probably in one of these houses. You don't look like a daughter. Okay. We didn't get that one before. Now we got it. We're still missing one. Cave to Sundleton need the hook. Oh, right, we need to be outside. I think that I think it's that one. I think we did not have the hook at that time, so we weren't able to get it. There's the cave tip to Sundleton, so let's go to Elsin. Now that's the secret skills cave. That's fine. just going to wander around here for a while and see if I can just find it. I mean, if you insist on fighting. We got all of them. Turns out I just wandered to the exact correct location.
Okay. So now we go to the Dragon Egg Shrine on the island next to the small town of Pico. Which is an appropriate name for a small town. There it is. Oh, now we get to fight whales. Whale, whale, whale. What do we have here? I mean, it's not exclusive to Raid. It's pretty much any free-to-play game. Which brings us to, the, to, to today's sponsor, Nobody. I don't have sponsors on the channel. Anyway, hello. I see you've collected eight dragon eggs. Choose a wish. So we can do 10 sources, 20 fruits, a might shield. A set of super rings. Hmm. Well, we have three super rings already, and we can just we can grind for fruits. It's not too much of an issue. Not worried about the sources. I'm gonna go with the shield. I see. I shall make your wish come true. There is where we get the uh, the animation where the the eggs float up into the sky and then explode in different directions and become inert for a year, except they don't do that last part. So now, if we really want it, we could uh, go look for the eggs again, and then again, and then again. And then something happens. Um, and there is something that we have that could make our life a little easier. And that is, if I can find it, the chest sonar. This will make a sound for every unopened chest in a uh, in a dungeon, probably in every room, which is pretty much like required if you're going for another set of dragon eggs. And from what I understand, like, there are likely locations where the eggs can reappear, but it's a little more random than the first game. By the way, I might want to equip that shield. Apparently went to Arteo. Okay, um, Selwyn, take us away. Go back to Chade. And actually, before we go any farther, we should probably take a break. It seems like a good time to do that. Anyway, y'all can take a moment, get something to drink, go to the bathroom if you need to, stretch your arms, stretch your legs, stretch your teeth, and in about 10 to 15 minutes, uh, we shall go to the land of mermaids and uh, see what happens there. See if we can find the dual blade. So, see you in a bit.